Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Heather, and today we are contouring with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit in the option Medium to Tan. And it is going to be a very quick tutorial, so we're going to go ahead and start off with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Foundation Stick in the shade Beige. I loved concealing with this foundation stick, and the shade is just perfect. It melts right into my skin. So now I'm going to just blend it all out very gently and now we're going to go ahead and conceal my under eyes with the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light Medium Honey. I also like using this under my eyes. Now I'm going to go ahead and use the lightest shade in the palette, the Peaches and Cream, on this small tapered e.l.f. blending brush. Um, you could see that there was a lot of product that it picked up and I'm just going to set my whole face. Now I'm going to take my Sigma Small Tapered Blending Brush E45 because of the pointed tip. I love it so much for contouring my nose. And I'm going to use the Havana and Espresso shades. I'm also going to take Havana and Espresso and blend it out with a regular blending brush and use the same shades to contour my face with. Now I'm going to go ahead and take the NYX Professional Makeup 12 brush and go in with the same shade espresso first uh, to contour my face and I love the shape of the brush and bristles because it's a soft contour that blends beautifully and I just love this as a contouring brush. It's just perfect to blend and now I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Japanese brush and I'm going to pick up the Havana shade and just go over my contouring very lightly, softly, all over the face. Now I'm going to go in the Gradient Palette kit and use the shade Vegas on my cheeks just to bring some life into there and go back into the contour kit and use the 10K highlighter and use the A23 brush to apply it. And this highlight is very subtle and beautiful and perfect in my opinion. I was very shocked and very happy that this kit came with that highlighter. So because the 10K is a natural highlighter, I am going to go in the Sugar Glow Kit palette and take Starburst to just intensify my nose a bit and end it all with the Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1 Replenishing Primer and Setting Spray, which I use all the time. It's one of my go-tos. And there we have it, our natural, easy makeup look. Okay guys, so final thoughts on the ABH Contour Kit Palette in the shade Medium to Tan option is that I actually really love this look that I've created. I'm not sure if I love setting my face with the powders, but at the same time, after I set it with a spray, it actually blended very well with my skin. And as you can see, I don't have a powdery face. At first I felt like it was powdery, but after setting it with a spray, it actually melted into my skin. So. This palette actually worked out for me and the shades are super subtle and beautiful and natural and that's actually my preference. Um, if you're looking for something blinding, obviously this highlight is not blinding but it is gorgeous in my opinion. Um, the peach shade here is a must if you want your skin to be radiant and younger looking and it's just a shade that I usually gravitate towards. And that's another reason why I gravitated towards this palette instead of the light to medium because light to medium does have the more shadowy shades, the ashy shades for that contour, but I actually really love the warmer shades for the face. I'm not a super warm lover of eyeshadows, but I love warmer, bronzier, kind of natural shades for your uh, <laughs> shades for your face so this palette definitely is something that i will be using in the future and in 
future looks that I will be creating, but I'm super glad I tried it out. It is something I have never tried out before, but I'm super happy I did. And my favorites would be the highlighter because I just love, look at that. I did use the uh, sugar glow on my nose, but I just like that to be super highlighted. Um, I also love the peach shade, and I actually love the two contour shades as well. So that was my video, guys. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial, swatch, all that good stuff, and my opinion, and this look like I do. And I will see you guys all next time in my next video. Bye guys!